So we see that the wealth index, the numerical values increase as the wealth index increases. We can create that variable. Now we want to create a variable which um, represents autonomy. Let's go down. Final say on healthcare. Let's just find the code book. Whether the respondent has any say in accessing healthcare for herself. The first two categories are the only ones in which the respondent or the woman has a say. In four, five, six, somebody else is taking the decision for her. Generate say in accessing healthcare is equal to one, but we would record record one equal to zero if it's greater than three. So for all those values higher than three, let's just check our final number. B seven four three A. There we go. And say so when for the first two categories the variable say health takes the value of one when the respondent has a say the woman has a say in uh, accessing health care for herself and zero otherwise if somebody else is taking the decision for her so it's a binary variable that takes the value of either one or zero let's uh, look at uh, work status that's another thing we should be looking at and work in the last 12 months. So I want to create a binary variable again for working where it takes the value of one if woman has is currently working or has ever worked. Is equal to one if it, she has worked. And we would recode this variable if working one equal to zero if B731 is equal to is equal to double equals to is equal to is equal to zero. This is our working variable. Again, okay, let's just check this. That makes sense. Um, now we want to look at uh, anemic status, anemia level. We always uh, look for the code book just to make sure we understand the variable. Well, what you see here is that um, as the level of anemia rises, the numeric value declines. So this is not really measuring the anemic level, it's measuring lack of anemia. So we wanted to convert the values, we want to reorder the values. So one way of doing it is generate anemia is equal to, how about we do four minus anemia level and let's just uh, you can see there are a lot of missing values, 7,540. Maybe those respondents weren't there for to give the blood or uh, their blood wasn't tested or blood could not be tested. Uh, so uh, keep in mind that we don't have uh, access to all the data points here. Tap this and anemia. And as you can see, the more severe it is, the higher the value. If she does not have any anemia, the value is zero. An interesting thing is, let's just look for correlation uh, between anemia and wealth. Minus 19. So this says that as wealth increases, the anemic um, severity declines, which makes sense. More rich you are, the better food you get to eat, and less likely that you would be anemic. Now, if we do PW correlation, PW, this will also test for significance 0 0.05 at the 5%, and it is significant as well. So, well, is significantly correlated with anemia. I want you to create the birth weight and uh, do the rest of them. Let's just run a basic regression here. The command is REG. I just want to look at 